everybody, in this video I'm going to talk to you about light bed trolling for Mai Mai, even called Dolphin or Dorado in Spanish. This is the fish that made sport fishing famous. Live bait trolling is a reliable way to target and catch my my of a kayak. To store and keep alive the bait, you need a live well. If you don't have enough room in your kayak, a live well made from a joint tube that is drawn along the side is an effective alternative. It can contain long shaped baits as mackerel or smackerel around sardinella. I use a trailer hook and a stinger hook on a 20 pound wire rig since in the same area there are a lot of bluefish and barracuda that can easily cut the line. The most effective and fast way to collect baits is represented by Sabiki rig fishing. You can catch multiple baits in a few minutes. Sardinella is the perfect size bait for Mai Mai and even for other predators. Even if the fish could get unhooked, it will follow the bait and sooner or later is going to eat it again. With his running and jumping out of the water, my mind can slack the line and easily shake the hook out and get free. When you hook up a Mai Mai, be prepared for more than one to show up, swimming around your boat. An important issue is how to manage 
catch this fish out of the water. This skin is very slippery. An effective way is the use of a bucket grip to hold him tightly. Another way, you can jump out of your boat and only if he's still hooked up, you can retrieve it. Fishing from a kayak gives you the advantage to be very silent so that often the fishes come next to your boat. Mai Mai is a very strong fish. In fact, its name in Hawaiian language means strong, strong. When you are not controlling him, it could be very dangerous, because the hooks can penetrate your wear or get into your skin. My outfit for light bed trolling is represented by short jingling roots like this. 20 pound 150 centimeter Mitchell Tanager in combo with the Daiwa Saltis Nero 4000 reel. I prefer spinning reels instead of conventional trolling reels because I can have the handle on the left since the rudder control on most of the kayaks is on the left side so that I can adjust the direction without passing the road from one end to the other. If you don't control the fish, you can jump in and out of your boat, causing the loss of your equipment and the hook penetration in the pants, like in this case. This is my heaviest setup for light bait trolling. Pan 50-80 pound pan battalion jig road paired with a pen slammer 8500 reel that normally used to target big fish like bluefin tuna, big amberjack or grouper. way to manage a Mai Mai on a kayak is a fish net in order to neutralize its power. This is my lightest tackle for light bed trolling, a 12 20 pound Shakespeare ugly stick jigs to kayak road with a pan spin Fisher VI 2500 light liner reel. The live liner technology leaves the fish to take the line without feeling tension. And when you turn the handle, the lever come back into position where the drag is set for fighting. My 
Mike jumps out of the water with him to slap the line and get her nuked. Cooley like this is a great fighter, needs a joy to fishing with light tackle like this. It's a sort of mini big game. They are green and gold with blue dots. They blend into the water perfectly. If you like this video, please leave a comment, like, share and subscribe. See you in the next video. Enjoy fishing!